Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. It's Chef Mark, and today, a much requested video, the pros and cons of a coil top range versus a flat glass electric range. What are the differences in the cooking? Pros and cons of each? Let's get started. Let's get started with the coil top. And why is it called the coil top? Well, I think it's fairly obvious. And what are the biggest advantages of the coil top? Well, price. You're looking at sometimes half the price of a glass top range. Another advantage of the coil top is that they're extremely simple. Now, let's take a look here. The elements just pull right out. They just plug in and out. They're very easy to clean because there's a pan here that's both dishwasher safe and replaceable. You can even get underneath here uh, with a vacuum cleaner, you can wipe down, and a lot of models, this entire thing lifts off for easy cleaning. So I would say that's a huge advantage if you're a messy cook like me. When shopping for a coil top range, keep in mind that some of them have a safety feature called the Sensi Tep Burner. So when you place a pot on this, it activates a spring which sends power to the coil and turns it on. So there's some advantages to this because you cannot accidentally leave the coil on. You take the pot off and it turns off. Uh, this can be a little frustrating if you're hoping to preheat your coil before you put your pan on. Uh, so just keep in mind that if you're buying this, you're buying safety, but you're buying a little less speed and convenience. Downsides? Well, there's a few. One, they're not as efficient as other types of ranges. These create a lot of heat, which will radiate out into your kitchen, heating up your home, heating up your kitchen. You're gonna feel that heat from a couple feet away. So if you're using a coil top, you can expect to see uh, an increase in your uh, energy bill. Now, let's go take a look at the glass top range and see what the pros and cons of those are. Clarify, this is not induction. Induction works a little differently. We have a lot of great videos here on this uh, YouTube channel about induction videos. Make sure you check those out. So what makes glass top so special? Well, first, ease of cleaning. Uh, I recommend wiping down your, your cooktop before you start cleaning to remove any dust and environmental dirt. That will go a long way towards helping keep this clean. Of course, you can use a glass top cleaner to get it perfectly clean, or if you're like me, I just wipe it down when I'm done cooking because I cook a lot at home. I'm always gonna have a little, little built-in uh, soil uh, showing on the top there. Another thing I like is the dual elements. Uh, you can match the size of your pot by either having a large or a small element kick on. It's a really nice feature. And finally, some of the nicer stoves have a warming zone in the back to help keep your, your soup or your chili warm and good to go. Let's take a look at how the sausage is made. This is a flat top uh, burner here. And what you can see is that we have um, a coil similar to a coil top range. Obviously they're much smaller and there's more of them. But what this does is this heats up this ceramic ring. This ceramic plate here then radiates the heat through the glass into your pot and into your food. So I would say based on my experience, that these are a little bit slower to heat up than a coil top, um, but once they get hot, you have a lot of heat and you have a little bit more control because you have that extra barrier of glass. If you do have a boil over, uh, if something um, cooks over, it's just hitting the glass, it's not getting down into uh, the stove and underneath that, uh, that burner, so you're less likely to suffer um, a smell from burnt food lingering in your kitchen. So what are the cons? Well, cost. Certainly the price of a, uh, a glass top range is much more expensive, sometimes double the price. Durability, the glass can crack. 
Um, if you drop a heavy pot on it from any height, you're in danger of cracking the glass. The glass is replaceable, but durability is less than a coil top. And finally, speed. These do take a lot longer to heat up, and then once they are hot, they take a lot longer to cool off. But you're picking up efficiency because you're not wasting all that heat into the environment. Which one's right for you? Well, it depends. Maybe you're a landlord and cost is really important to you. Then the coil top is definitely the way to go. Maybe you're a messy cook and you want to make sure your stove is perfectly clean. Mm, it's kind of a toss up because you can replace parts very easily on the coil top where it takes some elbow grease to get that glass top perfectly clean. For me, I have a glass top at home and quite frankly, I love it. Does it match up the gas? Not quite. Gas is the ultimate in control, but if you must have an electric range in your kitchen, you've got a lot of great options. This is Chef Mark. Make sure you like and subscribe, and thanks for tuning in.